Yeah. Sexy. Oh, I love this gimbal though. It's so freaking nice. Like, like, it's just so fantastic in every way possible. Except one. And it's this fucking tripod. I hate this tripod. It's just, it's just so shit. Because when you're out with this awesome thing and filming, you have to carry this shit around with you. And it sucks. But there is a solution. That is called, my friends, a cage from Small Rig for the gimbal. <laughs> this is probably not correct. Hell yeah! Small Rig has made a ring for this. I don't know why I haven't seen this before, but if this really works, this is gonna be the best shit ever. Seriously. a box inside of a box that played us again fellow friends right to be honest this is not the first ring I get the first small rig ring I got for this was offline it was a factory fault in it which sucked but my friends at Cafe Brus or Cafe Brus as you say it in Swedish they literally just said yo we'll send you a new one don't worry mate and here it is, the new one. So let's just unbox this real quick. These are the corners for our rig. Or should I call it rig? I'm gonna call it rig and if you say that this is not a rig, I will beat you with an ass. No, I will not because I can't be asked beating somebody because I will probably lose. Here are the handles. Let's just bring this out, this, this. And this right because I can't be asked buying legs for this cage I'm just gonna use the handles from the Ronin and what you get with them because I'm not paying $120 for a piece over a pair of legs there we go so these are gonna be our feet which we do not care about right now this can go as itself right so let's just hope that this is straight Right, so we got our main piece here, our bottom and our handles. Let's just start with the base, I guess. So let's just take these feet, or AKA the handles, and just softly screw them on. Right, so make sure that you have these aligned either to yourself or to the outside. I'm just gonna use them to myself here. So these feet or the rods, have a special bollocks. They have special cutouts here which perfectly align with the angles here and with the handles so far so good. And this fucker like so. Hell yeah, this is all good. Right, so you may think this does not look right. Well, you're absolutely correct. And this is why we're gonna put and screw this on right now. Right, so I'm not gonna actually tighten this yet. We're gonna to put this on. Boom. Oh yeah, that's nice. They have a lock that is already existing on yours so it won't fall off even though it's not tightened yet. So this is snug and tight. Hmm, so this feels, looks straight. I'm just gonna double check that it aligns perfectly. Now we can actually go ahead and tighten this main part here boom and there we go basically this is done um so this ring cage is fantastic i mean it's so nice because you can just film 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 you're feeling done tired just put it down and it will stand on its legs its own legs which is just fantastic now there are some couple of more things we have as you can see here we have a lot of mounting points on the top and all of the sides here with quarter range the nano, nano nano rails here basically shitloads of cool stuff oh, come on. jesus right so we need a top handle even though we have a lot of handles 
top sides and top and bottom and blah blah we're still gonna want to have a handle like this now this is just a regular small rig top handle cheap and it does the job what's next well monitor or monitoring blah, 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 i can't talk ah for this we're gonna use a small no it's not a small rig it's a no name magic arm uh i love these magic arms uh literally goes anywhere you want to i really want to know what kind of voodoo the shit this is but let's see we need a monitor which goes over here this is the atomos shinobi super nice monitor love it had it for a little while super super nice worth the price kind of rhymed but a boom right hdmi <sighs> nice so this is kind of it isn't it no it's not i forgot oh fucking hell oh fucking hell right because i have the tilta small no tilta follow focus right so the mounting stuff is not cheap if you want to have a rod adapter it's gonna go for around a hundred dollars here in sweden if you want to buy a 25 millimeter adapter to the screw on here even more money probably like 50 bucks but i found a solution so small magic arm with the quick release plate all you need to do my friends is to screw this on over here just like so and now we take our wheel and just put it inside of here and now we can just use it with a thumb super nice i mean yeah now we don't need tripods this is a tripod as well as our cage as our handles as everything like this is so much easier to store because you just take this off put away the gimbal or take it off the camera and it's case briefcase mode or whatever it's called you don't need 25 million accessories like these two let's just compare size though should we do that let me just let me just give you an example for real so we're gonna put this down we need this you have to have this like so like so you have to screw this piece of shit off yeah this like so like so look how much space this is and you have to have these handles the other smaller handles oh it's just such a pain in the ass look how much stuff this is compared to this now it looks the same but don't forget how many pieces this is this is a tripod and these are just when you have just literally eight parts four handles this weighs not more than this is probably just like 300 grams, if not less. These, these just don't take up any space at all compared to this piece of shit. Yeah, guys, top notch. I hope this wasn't too long of a video. It's super nice. I love it. Check out Cafe Brews. They're super nice people. They have a lot of cool stuff. And I mean, yeah, have a super great day. And... Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you next time.